Okay, in this video, we're gonna find the mean or the average of a data set. The formula for finding the mean or the average is the sum of all of our terms divided by the number of terms that we have. In case you are unfamiliar with this symbol, this symbol is sigma, it's uppercase sigma, and it is summation notation. which basically just is telling you it's a nice way, a shorthand way of saying add up all of your terms. Okay, so anytime you see this symbol in mathematics, it means the sum of all of the terms. X just represents whatever variable you're talking about. In this case, our variable is going to be our test scores. Every test score is different for each individual person. That's why it's considered a variable. In statistics, we do have two different notations for mean and it deter it depends on whether you're dealing with a sample which is a subset of the population or whether you are dealing with the population mean for a sample mean we use what's read as x bar this is read as x bar and for the population mean when you're talking about the entire population we use mu and mu is a Greek letter. So for this, what we are going to do is we have six test scores from a class. Since it is just six test scores, this is a sample. Um, a population could be six, but most of the time your population is going to be much larger. So in this case, this is a represents a sample mean. So we are going to use X bar as our notation. And what we are going to do is we are going to take our values and add them up. That's what the sum of x means. So 75 plus 80 plus 85 plus 90 plus 72 plus 74. And we're going to divide that by the number of terms. In this case, since we have six terms, we would divide by six. So if I add up all of these values, I end up with 476 divided by six which is approximately 79.33. So we could say that the average or the mean of these test scores is 79.33. As always, thanks for watching.